Hi everybody. Today is Monday, April 6th. I hope everybody's staying healthy and we're just the picture of grit and determination and keeping a light on for the rest of our families and loved ones, staying strong and healthy. And I have some weights here. I have some plates, a little bit of an uneven surface out in the grass, but it's so beautiful outside, how to do this outside. So Darren, let me know that there have been some requests for the Tuesday power sculpting class. So that's what we're gonna go with. I'm gonna turn some music on and I'm gonna try to keep the beat, try to keep it even on both sides, but don't kill me if I am a little uneven. All right, guys, here we go. Get the music going. I'm out of the picture for a second here. and cedar knolls. Four more. A little warmer. Two more. Last one, you're going to hold it down. A little pulse. Drop it at that booty cheek. 
little burn back there. How's that brain working? Keeping it fresh, last four, three, and we're gonna lunge, alternating reach. So alternate the legs, both arms extended up. And as you go back, try to lift your heart a little bit higher. Feeling a nice opening through the hip flexor so as it's spending a lot of time on the computer and seated, right? Watching a lot of TV or not. Netflix and chill, right? Lots of that. I think we'll have had enough of it after this is over for the whole year. Last one, hold it down. Give me a little pulse. Grip that glute. Gonna lean forward, reach your arms back. Take your hands to your heart, rotate. In and up, in and up. Nice rotation here. A little adaptation from yoga with movement. One more. Three. And switch. Hold it, little pulse. Drop it, hands up. Yeah, warming up those legs. Hands to the heart, we'll rotate in and up. You wanna watch the knee collapsing here. You wanna make sure that knee's not rotated in too much. Ribs are drawing in. Yeah, yeah, four more. you guys so much. Two and one. Let's walk the hands down to the ground. Now whatever you have, a towel, a mat, if you don't have a mat, just work that plank here. We're going to rock forward and back. So you're going to go on your toes, push through your heels. Draw the ribs up and away from the ground. Chin to the floor. Shoulder blades pull together. If that hurts your hands, you can always come down on your elbows. The lats together, you really want to activate them. Four to go. We're going to open and close the right leg, working the adductor, adductor, abductor. Then close. Open. You want to flex your foot, keep the leg off the ground if you have to. You can drop that bottom knee. Yeah, so your left knee can come to the ground. Right leg opening. Nice tight tush here. Ribs in. We have four to go. Woohoo! And hot. All right, everybody, switch sides. Left leg working out. We're trying to keep the hips as stable as possible. No rocking. Nice and strong through that core. Eight to go. Eight. Seven. Six, foot is flex, press out with your ankle. Inner ankle squeezes in. Two. All right, let's hold and walk the feet to the hands. We're gonna roll up nice and easy. Give me a little shoulder action, get warm. Shirt's gotta come off. And we're gonna do a little squat press. So, if you need to modify this, lighter weights, keep the hips, from going all the way down toward the ground. All right, roll your shoulders back, chest nice and high. Hands on the shoulders. We're just gonna drop the elbows to the thighs. Squat, press. Now you wanna keep your chest lifted a little here. So you're gonna look up just a little, right? See the tops of those trees up there. Give me a press. And up. And up. Drive with your legs, pelvic floor lift, booty squeeze. Big exhale, I have 10 pounds here. Some oldies donated from the Chatham Club. Last two, last one. Hold it down, pulse it out. Keep your chest lifted, right? Weight back, ribs in. Feel those toes 
Fingers have to move too, right? Eight, seven, four, three. I'm gonna put one of those weights down. Standing nice and tall. Bring the arms overhead. We're gonna alternate a knee drive. In, release. In, release. So focus on bringing that thigh as high as you can. You can get it chest high, go for it. Pulling overhead, pull. Contract. Keep it coming, need to go. In, and in. Four more, four, three, two. Now hold it right here, you're gonna rotate left, right, left, right, left. Tight ribs. You wanna hold two weights here, you can keep them on your shoulders. Another eight, eight, seven. Making yourself nice and narrow. If you can see any reflection of yourself anywhere, make sure you're not leaning back or forward here. Two more. All right, we're gonna squat and bring the elbow to the opposite knee. Squat, rotation, squat, rotation. So left elbow to right knee, right elbow to left knee. Big push, drop it up. Eileen Flanagan's watching. Eileen, shout out. Hopefully I'm doing even on both sides. I haven't had a problem with it yet. We haven't done anything really one sided yet. My Tuesdays, you know what's, what's up with that. Four, three, two, one. Hold it. Hands up, wider feet. We're gonna squat, contract, contract, release, contract, Release. So from the side, in. This is a gigantic standing crunch. Woo! Working all that pasta off. And we're doing pasta in this Italian house. Exhale. The rose. Four more. Yeah. Two. One, we're gonna place the weight in the left hand. Reach, right hand, sorry. It's a little side bend action. Make sure this is going right to your side. You're not going in front of your knee or behind your knee. We're gonna extend all the way to the side. You wanna make it harder, top arm reaches up. We're gonna hold it down in four counts. Three, two, Give me a whole push down. You're taking that hand right toward that ankle. Make sure you're breathing. Really important that we maintain a good, strong breath here throughout. Four, three. Let's switch sides. So in the left hand, right hand behind the head. Down, let's go. Good again, nice and tight in there. Working right down to that ankle. Anybody know when this is going to be over? Oh, we don't know, so we're just going to keep working. Yeah. Two. And hold it. Give me a hold. Press. Press. Down. A little lower if you can. You can extend that right hand. Eight to go. Eight. Seven. Four. Three. Two. Let's release that weight. Shake it out a little bit. I'm going to go a little bit heavier here. I have a 12, if you don't have anything like that, maybe two 10s or a uh, two fives in your hand if you have that. If not, don't worry about it. You can use what you've got. We're gonna step forward with the left foot. Right leg's gonna come back. We're gonna reach down, row, and pull that foot in. In, release, in, release. It's nice and deep. Draw the elbow back. You wanna activate the back of the shoulders. So if we're seated a lot, that those muscles start to relax and overstretch, right? You want to counteract that with a little contraction. Now, pulse three, pull in on four. One, two, three, draw it in. Press, 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 pull it in. 
gonna drop that back knee a little deeper, pull it in. Low, lower, lowest, and in. Down, 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 and up. And you're trying to overload that right cheek, hamstring, pull it up. See you're all getting out walking. I don't think I've ever walked as much as I have the past two weeks. Down. My neighbors are starting to think I'm a stalker. Two. One more. Now we're going to hold that same weight with both hands. We're going to rotate. Down. Rotate. Woo -hoo. And in. Woo. Right legs getting fatigued. Down. Lift up. Keep working. Try to bring the elbow all the way around. To that thigh. There we go. Jen. Four. Working with me, I hope. All right. Release. Shake that out a little bit. Let's take the right leg back. Row in with that right arm. Tap in with the right leg. Core strong. Head neck relaxed. Relax your jaw. Maintain some muscle tone. Summer will be here whether we, we're ready or not, right? We all imagining being on the beach next to each other in the sand with towels and blankets. Four more. Three. Here comes that pulse. Pulse three. Down, low, lower, and row. Down, lower, lower, and row. Drop, drop, pull up. Yeah. Feeling that bootay. Down, down, pull it in. Breathe. Yes. That's some pre-mix music here. That is not original artist because I don't want our music to get flagged. That's been happening a lot on streaming videos. One more. Woo! We're going to rotate, hold the weight with both hands. Down, twist. Obliques. Abs. Abs, baby abs. Shout out to Chrissy Stanley. Keeping my abs in shape on her bar videos. Doing a fabulous job. Find her on Facebook Live. Four more. Whoop. Two. All right, we're going to do a kettlebell swing. Shake that out a little. Feet wide. Turn them out. Feet turned out. Down. Sweep up. Really important that you use your hips and glutes on this. So it's a hip rocker, right? Hips lift. Drive the hip forward. Squeeze, squeeze, there you go, two, all right gang, hold it, weight up high, if you can, heels are off the ground, knees are pushing out from the hips, turn those, push the uh, hips and knees out, four more, now you're going to hold, push away, open, yeah, yeah, Woo. Another eight, seven, four, three. All right, all right, shake that out. Try right, little bicep time. And we'll work our legs. So what I'm trying to do is keep you moving so that your heart rate is up, right? Heart rate's up, sweating, working the muscles, everything's happening at the same time. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we go. We're gonna add a knee lift. And down, curl, down, lift. So your palms are up, bring your hands all the way to your shoulders, all the way to the floor. Again, if this weight is too heavy, you go lighter. If it's not challenging, definitely wanna go heavier. In four, we're gonna hold the left leg up. In two. One. Now hold the hands right in the center. You're going to hold that left leg up and give me a pulse. Try not to lean backwards. You're 
rotating from the inner thigh. And you want to use your inner thigh, not your hip flexor, right? So you don't want to feel it here, you want to feel it here. Eight to go. Eight, seven, four, three, and release. Hammer curl, and up. So we started on that right knee, and lift. Your arms are getting fatigued, you can always alternate the hands like so. Otherwise, you continue to work in unison. Standing tall like a soldier. Chest high. One more each. You're gonna bring that right leg up. Hands in the middle. Lift, lift. Yeah, gripping that left glute too. Inner right thigh, eight, seven, four, three, two, and release. Now, we're gonna roll over. I'm gonna do a little rear fly here. If you need to go heavier, awesome, go for it. You wanna hinge at the hip, and stick that booty out, with your arms hang, chin down, and you're gonna reach up and lower. You wanna feel this movement right in the back of your deltoids. Lift and lower. Rear delts working. I'm not gonna look at the camera. You don't wanna strain the neck. Eight more. Can you see my roots? OMG, people. Two more. One more. Now, let that come down. Let's let those weights down. We're gonna do a little deadlift action, right? So I'm gonna turn sideways. Weight even on the heels. Lower, two, three, four, lift it up. And you wanna grip the booty strong. Pelvic floor as well. Arms hang heavy. Up, right there. All right, nice flat back. So if I had a broomstick on my back, it would not be bending forward. It would be going straight toward you. Straight toward my house. Grip that, push, lower. Two, three, four, squeeze up. Very slow control. You don't want to feel this in your lower back at all. It's up and up. Row to this, get ready. Four up. So we're gonna come forward. Down, two. Row, release, row, release, lift up. Repeat that. Down, two, two rows. Release, lift up. Keep working, I'm gonna go a little heavier. Down, two, row two, lift up two. Again, make sure your heels are really pressing into the ground. Uh-oh, I forgot the rows. We're off the beat there, sorry gang. Again, down, two, up, two, lower, lift. Down, two. All right, trying to shine a light from that booty back there. Up, and lower. Thank God there's a fence behind me, right? Up, last time here, forward, squeeze, squeeze, and lift up, and release. Let's get a, a little undo of the, all that forward bending, right? So hands behind the head, right? And I want you to just pull your elbows back, squeeze back, squeeze back. Yeah, eight, seven, four, three, reach over your elbow side to side, left, right. You don't need to go deep here, right? We're just trying to undo all that forward bending, trying to activate the waist, the back muscles. Eight more. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Let's get some triceps in. And three. And two. All right, guys. We are going to stand tall. Uh, I think I'm going to use 
use one weight here. So I'm gonna use one 12 pound weight, standing nice and tall. If you'd like to, you can always bring the weights behind your back, right? So go lighter with two weights and do a kickback. If this bothers your neck, elbows forward, ready, down and up. Now I'm gonna add a little bit of a squat. Actually, let's go wide with the feet. A little easier on the knees. Push away. You wanna bring the weight to the back of your neck. Right, back of your shoulders, really, not your neck. So feel in the back of those arms, feel them stretch at the bottom of the movement. In four, we hold, we're gonna pulse. Four, three, two. Hold it down, give me a pulse. Hey, yeah. Take that chin off your chest, Jen. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and release that. Yeah, yeah. All right, let's grab a plate. We're gonna keep that one heavy weight. Let's see if this works out in the grass, yeah? So just cheapo paper plates. If you have gliders, good for you. That works too. So you're gonna put the weight in your left hand. The plate is under your left foot. We're gonna give it a row here. Reach, slide in. I really want you to activate your inner thigh on this. Nice, strong inner thigh. Reach, pull. Lots of rowing to counteract all our sitting. In four, we're gonna hold that down. Four, three, two. Hold it, give me a pulse. Weight on that thigh. Just drive that leg out. Woo, yeah. Push away, push away. Eight, seven. Little inner thigh pulse. Four, three, and switch. Right hand, right leg. Ready? Here we go. Down, draw it in. Reach right to that big toe. Spread the weight all the way across your left foot. Yes. Four more, and then we hold. Three, two. Hold it, pulse it out. Press, press. Watch the knee. Make sure it's not collapsing in. Push it outward. Eight, seven, four, three, and roll that up. Oh! All right, shake it out a little bit. We'll do a little rainbow action here. So balancing, standing tall on your right leg. You're gonna hold that weight. I want you to rotate in, out, in, in. Bringing your, if you can, you're going to try to keep that thigh off the floor. Three. Now hold the leg. You're going to circle the weight all the way around. Just bringing all your awareness into your whole torso. Working that right leg here. Reverse the circle back the other way. Yeah, ha, ha. You can keep that foot off the ground the whole time. Awesome. If not, you stabilize with the toe for a sec. Come back. You can kickstand if you need to. All right. And switch. Woo. Leg burn. Ready? Here we go. Elbow. In. Out. In. In. Lots of awareness in that left leg here. Cross, cross, keep working. Oh, a little rocky action, that's us. Hold it, we're fighters, baby. Nothing's stopping us. Great determination, we got this. Two more that direction. And reverse the circle. It's not really a rainbow, it's a big circle, right? It's a full rainbow. The 360 rainbow. Four, three, two. Yes, yes. All right, we're gonna take the right foot, bring it forward, left leg's coming back. We're gonna chop forward and extend to that big toe. Lift, lower. 
up. Yes, it is. Fight hard, you're getting strong. Eight more. Four, we're gonna hold it down and pull. Three, two, hold it. In, in. Dwayne, I always think of you when I do this. Where are you? Keep working. Keep going. Hey! Right cheek! Eight more. Eight, seven, four, three, and switch. Ready? Reach to that big toe. Up, back. Stabilizing on the left. Yes. Looking at heart rate here. Four. Three. Ready? Pull it in. Lots of repeaters here. Dig deep. Chat and pluck. Getting it done at home. Woo! A little mud. Eight more. Four, three, two, one. All right. We're going to stay away from that soft area back there before I break my neck. All right. Let's take it to the floor. Hands on the mat, elbows down if you need to. Draw that right knee in, out, in, out. Turning sideways, in, out. Your hips low if you can. Not so low they touch the floor, but switch legs, in, out. Plank crunch here. Four to go. Four. Three. Two. All right, walk it up. Ah, give me a little shake. I don't want to work a little side leg out with you. So no weights. Hold your arms up. You're going to take your hands to your right outer thigh. Out. Out. Flex your foot. So you want to feel that right here. You put your forefinger on the front of your psoas and your thumb on your hip. You want to feel that side of the glute activating. Now, so you can leave the arms out. Make sure you feel this here and not in the front. Flex your foot down. Four, three, two, switch sides, right? So forefinger on the hip or the front of the thigh, hip area, thumb on the top of the glute. You wanna make sure that outer thigh is activated. Flex foot. And outer thigh. Be working. Two. Back on the right leg. Here we go. Hold it up. Lift. 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 Straight arms if you can. Oh yeah. Eight. Seven. Four. Three. Change sides. Exhale. Exhale. Push, push, another eight. Feeling some love for sure. Also in the waist here, right? Three, switch, eight, seven. I say Geronimo, switch, no quitting. 
Ten quit. Four to the right. Four left. Two two. Switch. Bombs away, baby. Single. Right, left. Right, left. Little baby right here at her thighs. Final. Eight. Take the left foot behind the right foot and just kick back and tap out. Push, tap out. So these fives are a little light for me. I'm gonna go tens, keep working. Another eight, back and up. Four, three, oh yeah, feeling that. Now hold it, press, up. And up, try to lift your hands. This is hard with these heavy weights. Get out of your neck, everybody. Lift your hands up past your hips. Seven, six, five, let that neck go. Three, two, and switch. Right behind left, kicking back. Back and up. Right into that hip. Hands past the hips. Four. Three. Two. Hold it. Hands up. Past the hips. If possible. Final. Eight. Seven. Four. Three. All right, all right. Shake that. Shake it. What are we doing? Feeling it, feeling it, feeling it. In this, I want you to come down on your knees. And take a weight and place it under your left hand. Right leg out to the side. We're going to lift that side leg out. Lift, lower. So this kind of goes along with those side leg raises we were just doing without weights. A little hair fly action going on. Try to stop the foot just shy of the floor. Burning right here. Oh yes, four more, four, three, two, it's ugly, but good for you. Here we go, gang, hold it up. Lift, 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 I'm feeling your pain right now. I say Geronimo, eight more, eight, seven, six, we're gonna do a child's pose in three, two, oh yeah. You need to do this before we go on the other side. Stretch that back out. I want you to turn your palms toward the ceiling so you stretch your lats out. If your lats get really tight, it will move into your lower back. So make sure you're stretching those lats out. All right, let's do the other side. The weight under the right hand, left leg extended, lift and lower. Again, you're trying to keep the foot as long as possible. You have to bend your knee, bend your knee, right? Shorten it up if you need to. Up. Up. Push away from the hip. Lift. Four more. Breathe. Lift up. Try not to collapse into that right hand. Hold. Lift. Ow! Oh, baby. Eight. Seven. Six. Collapsing. Four. Three. Two. Oh, yeah. All right, let's do a little shake that. All right, little tricep overhead one more time, like kneeling. All right, so we're going to be on our knees. Elbows wide this time. Down, push out. Down, push out. So you're here. The booty's nice and tight. All right, supporting your back, supporting your torso. Elbows push away. Chin off the chest. All right, chin not lifted, but off the chest. 
eight. If this hurts your shoulder in any fashion, do a kickback. I like to work those tries. Four more. Staying tall. Hold it, pulse it. Up, up. It's burning all right. Seven, six, five. Last four, three, and release that. Let that come down. So we're gonna go back to deadlifts. We're gonna go wide with our feet this time, okay? So feet are wide, toes are turned out, arms are heavy, roll your shoulders back, chest high, hinge at the hip, stick your booty out, and squeeze up. So this is gonna work the glute medius, as well as the hamstring, hits the booty and the hammies from a different angle. Straight back with your butt, crown of the head forward toward me. Trying to make sure I'm not using too much space because I know how tight space is, space is in my house when I'm working out. It's a little tiny pockets of space. I'm trying to make use of. Squeeze that butt. Down, two, up, two. Down, two. Give me a little shoulder roll on that up. Down, two, up. You need to bend your knees. Go ahead and bend your knees. Last two here, guys. Down, two, up. Down, two. All right, a little balance work. So you're gonna stay on your right foot. Squeeze that right cheek really hard. Find some flat space. We're gonna come down, two. Oh yeah. Down, two. Take the left knee, touch the back of the right calf or ankle. Taking you there, down, two, lift up and up. I'm not doing a lot of shoulder work. I figured getting lots of shoulder work in other videos if you've done any of Frank's workouts. Tons of shoulder work in there. Two to go. Oh. Last one. Down. Other leg. Find firm ground. Squeeze your bum and down. And up. Actually squeeze both. Down and up. Find something to stare at. Right there. Looking at focal point. Arms hanging heavy. No stress in the neck. Don't need that. Stay strong and healthy through this. Come out swinging on the other side. Last two. Last one. You can do a little rotation with the torso. Let one weight go. All right, so plant. Your feet softly, right? Soft knees. You're gonna rotate down to the right, take it up to the left. Push down, pressing up. Whole body working. All is one unit. Drive it up. Loose jaw. Drive up. You can touch the floor, go for it. Give me two. Give me one. You're gonna hold the center. Move that weight quick, 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 quick. Tighten your core, tight as you can. No shaking, just your hands. Tight, 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 tight. Belly punch, eight, seven. Four, three, we're gonna go down to the left, up to the right. Lean and drive up. Oh yeah, leaves are budding on the trees. Big exhale. Hyacinths are up, daffodils are up. Big push. Hydrangeas making their way, right? They're budding. Grass nice and green. Blue sky. Enjoy it. Enjoy every second of it. Two to go. All right, one more time with that push.
push, push, push. Gut punch. Get ready for it. Eight, seven, four, three. We're going to do a little baseball swing. Hold the edge of the weight. If you have a water bottle, hold on to it with two hands. You're going to come down, swing left. Down, swing left. Left, hand, left hand, it's this is for you. Shh. Shh. Down and around. Oh man, do we miss baseball? Basketball, all our sports? No doubt. Four more. Two. All right, let it go side to side. Nice and easy, and we'll go to the other way. Ready? Down, swing to the right. Snack. Right. Wanna hear the crack of that baseball bat? Exit. You can always go through this motion with no weight in your hand. Just clasp your hands together. Very efficient. working pelvic floor lifts. Four more. Two. One. Yes. All right, let that go. Let's go light. We'll do a little bit of shoulder work here. Right there. Ooh, out. Open. Thumbs to the ceiling. Pull it back. Hold. No 
shoulder pain, muscle yes, joint no. Hold it up. Yahoo! Whoa, work it, nipping it, happening. Finally, on eight, seven, six, five. On the side. down, stack those legs, lift and lower. So again, you need to bend in your knees, extend your spine, make yourself as long as you can, that top arm can add a weight, you can lift your top leg if that feels right, that bothers my bottom knee so I'm not going to go there, feels good, go for it. So this is where 
there and rotate. So you're going to reach out with your left arm. Bring your right arm up here over. Come back to center. Left leg down. Uh oh, the beans are bugging. Side side. Sawing going on behind me there. Touch your foot.